one of the questions we get asked often is, would you recommend a laser engraved or a sound carved plaque? Well, let me show you the difference. So first, let's look at a traditional laser engraved plaque. These are the type of plaques that are offered across the web all over the place. Um, but keep in mind that not every person knows how to laser engrave. Just because someone has a laser machine, that doesn't mean that they know how to laser engrave photos on marble or granite. Let me show you. This is after you do some Photoshop on, on the picture and you fix it up nicely, then you're gonna get nice results. And this is a laser engrave right here. It comes out beautiful, don't get me wrong. It's very, very beautiful. And these will last forever. But the etching is on the surface only. So what does that mean? Uh, if someone were to get sandpaper, which I really doubt they will, they can scratch it off and make it all dull and, and not glossy at all. If that doesn't happen, which it won't happen most likely, then it will last for a very, very, very long time. Now, let me show you an option of sand carp. So here's an option of sand carp. Take a look at that. If you, the first thing I want you to notice is that. You see that? Is that we put a special film coverage onto it. We do the same exact process that we do with these, okay? But we do more than that. After we've done laser engraving it, we introduce it to this machine. This is a sand carve cabinet. So with the sand carve cabinet, we have this hose and it's connected to a high pressure uh, air, air, air tank. And there is tons of sand in here. So when it's on, the sand will push out of the hose onto the granite and whatever is not uh, covered with a special film gets blasted. So now that you saw that, when it gets blasted, it allows to be more indentations onto the rock. So it does not just do the surface, it actually does a deep engraving. You can't really see it because of the light, but it definitely does a deeper engraving. You can feel the, you can feel the engraving. Not only that, but by doing so, it allows it to fill it with a special monument paint that's, that is only two allowed by the U.S. government for the U.S. monuments. And we use one of those tools. And that's why this picture comes out this way. And it's been tested for uh, several temperatures, um, very high temperature, very low temperature. Um, I believe several hundred times, several thousand times. I'm not sure, I have to double check. I'm going to low and high temperature to see uh, what it does with the paint and it's, it stands up. So there you go. The marble you see here, they're also sand carved and paint filled. Okay. But the main purpose of this video is to show you the difference and answering your question regarding laser engrave and sand carve. Thank you guys. This is Vidal again with My Forever Memories. Please like, subscribe, and follow if you know anybody that will love one of our products, whether it's a laser engraved granite. Small business. Let's hear the, the uh, uh, motorcycles outside driving by. Yes, we work out of our home. This is what my wife and I do for a living, and our kids support us. Sam Card, laser engraved. Marble. Sam Card. Sam Card. So now that you know the difference between sand carb and laser engrave, I um, hope that you'll be able to trust us with your pet uh, memorial. Uh, we also do these for uh, humans as well. Sometimes we do like garden plaques and we're starting to put them in pixelgifts.com for that, which is our human memorial area. Right now we have only beautiful uh, indoor plaques, just like this one here. But we're going to add some outdoor garden plaques, which a lot of customers actually go into MyForeverMemories.com and buy them there for their loved ones as well. And I want to give them a place too at PicksAndGifts.com. So stay tuned. Check us out. MyForeverMemories.com, PicksAndGifts.com. We are Vidal and Ada. We do pet memorials and we do people memorials as well. Take care. Be safe and God bless.